Hey guys, first I want to say thank you for subscribing. We just reached 14,000 subscribers. I hope to get to 20k by the end of the year. In today's video, I want to talk to you about the order of the plugins when mixing vocals. What should you use first? EQ, compression, deessers. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe, notification, comment, all that good stuff. Thanks again and uh, let's get into the video. Let me play the track, it's called Headshot. I will have a link to the track in the description. Hey, would you fly? Get up, I'ma got you bobbing. Walk up in it, clean up than everybody. everybody. I'ma take a picture like the fed watch. Snapshot. Thought a snitching when the fed got fed got him. I don't want to she a head dog. head dog. Put the scope on about the red dog. Red dog. Aiming at the throat, yeah, I'm a head shot. The vocals are unprocessed. I like to start with the sense. I like to add some reverb. I like to add some delays. Get up, I'ma got you bobbing. Walk up in it, clean up the near body. Let's add the ping pong delay. Body. I may take a picture like the Fed watch. Start a snitch when the Fed got him. This is the first step, adding some spatial plugins, a reverb and delay. The next thing I like to do is to add parallel compression. Get up, I'm a got you bop. For this uh, track, I've used the PSP Fat Pressor instead of the CLA 76. Now the vocals blend better with the beat. I want to get a feel for the entire track. The next step, and I do this all the time, is to use a corrective EQ. That can be stock plugin from uh, Studio One or any other DAW that you're using. I like using Fab Filter Pro Q2. As you can see, it already has high pass at uh, 10 kilohertz. Very low, you cannot hear it, but it really helps with the workflow. Clean the low end, the rumble. Hey, with the black, watch bob. Walk up in it, clean up. After I have a low cut, then I check for frequencies that I don't like. I don't want to see a head, dog. And I just clean the, the vocals. After the first EQ is the tuning plugin. Auto tune, the key is A minor. Let's check. She a head dog, head dog. Put the scope on about the red dot, red dot. Aiming at the throat, yeah, I'm a head shot. Hey, with the black, get up, I'm a got you. I'm using autotune just subtle, it gives a certain character to the vocals, I like that. Next, in the chain, if I have a dark vocal that needs some top end, I will add another EQ to add some top end. I like using the mag EQ from uh, Plugin Alliance. Walk up in it, clean up than everybody. everybody. I may take a picture like the Fed watch. Start a snitch when the Fed got him. I don't want to she a head doctor. Put the scope on about the red doctor. I hear some, some harshness in the vocals. Another plugin that I use sometimes in the beginning of the processing is a DSR, or DSR, which is a bandpass. With the side chain, you can listen for that frequency that's harsh. Let's uh, find it. Walk up in it, clean up the everybody. Because the next plugin is a compressor, I want to control the nasty frequencies before hitting the compressor. Let's bring uh, the first compressor, CLA 76. Start a snitch when the Fed got him. I don't want to see a head doctor. Put the scope on about the red doctor. Aiming at the throat, yeah, I'm a head shot. Hey, with I don't compress the vocals that much. I have a 4 to 1 ratio, I have a fast uh, release relative slow attack uh, that's it for the for the first compressor next i usually have a tonal eq if the the vocals need some help in the top end or to add more body just add a pull textile eq i'm another throw yeah i'm a head shot hey with the black get up i'm a got you bob walk up in it clean up the near body after the tonal EQ, I usually have the second compressor, the CLA 2A. I ain't another throw, yeah, I'm a head shot. Hey, with the black, get up, I'm a got you bop. Walk up in it. Another quick tip, level match after each plugin, so you don't have to adjust the, the fader position. Just one compressor working very hard, it will be very obvious. Every single compressor is not compressing that much. The final result will be a very consistent vocal. Distortion if needed. Uh, let's say decapitator, I use this most of the time with uh, default settings. Hey, with the black, get up, I'm a got you bop. 
Last in the chain for me is uh, a DSer. I may take a picture like the Fed watch. Started snitching when the Fed got him. I don't want the. So this is the plugin order that I use. I usually change the plugins, but the order pretty much stays the same. So I have corrective EQ, uh, pitch correction, top end with an EQ, a DSer to control some of that range from 2K to 4K, a first compressor, some subtle compression, not that much. Then I have a tonal EQ, the second compressor, a saturation if needed, and last in the chain is a DSer. And also I have ascends, reverb delays, parallel compression. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please subscribe, hit that notification button, drop a like, leave a comment with suggestions, follow me on Instagram, follow me on Facebook, join our Facebook group, it's called Mixed Talk. Thanks for watching. Cheers.